Hello everybody, I just want to show you a cute little tip you may not have noticed um, when you noticed our recent changes to uh, our release. When you default drop a button onto the screen, it is automatically formatted to have rounded corners. I wanted to talk to you a little bit about that. Also understand that any default additions that you add to the screen will always take into account the theme. So buttons will respond to the theme that you've selected, but they always basically have these rounded corners. And some people have said, well, how do, how do I, you know, I don't want the rounded corners. Now, the old way we used to manage anything rounded is we would use the four properties, radius bottom left, radius bottom right, radius top left, and radius top right. So for instance, right now by default, the radius for all of these properties is 10. If I change it to 20, then you'll notice that the button will be more rounded. Okay, and you'll see here's the default button down here, and there's the one that I just did by changing the radius for each corner to a higher number. Now I can also kind of do some funky things and go in like from top left and make this zero and bottom right and make this zero and you'll get a funky looking button that only has two corners rounded. So it's kind of a cool thing to work with the radius properties, but a lot of people have said it's a little time consuming. I got four properties to worry about. So in our new properties panel over the right, over at the right here, and I want you to notice that, notice the name of the control is exposed here on this property panel so that I can go ahead and rename this here. Buttons, I'm gonna call this button square. And you'll notice over on the Tree Explorer view, it also is called button square. This used to be up into the ribbon and now it's here. But in addition to all these new properties that we have, I wanna point out this radius option here, which is right here. So instead of having four properties, this is an override that will make all four corners the same. So if I change this from 10, which is this default rounded, if I change that 10 to zero, guess what? We'll have a square button. So a lot of people have asked, how can I have a square button? Well, it's much easier now than it was before. You don't have to go and change all your radiuses. Whatever you put in here will be applied to all four. It will override those properties. And so just wanted to share that with you today. A lot of you are trying to make interesting looking buttons, and now you can. Happy power apping.